I have never been so jealous of a little girl in my life. Today, I am grooming a litter of German Shepherd puppies, and the owner's daughter, McKinley, is here to help me. They are covered in poop and need a good bath before going to their new homes. We are starting out with male number one. Okay, so you're going to pet the puppy while I make him wet so he's not so scared, okay? Give him a nice pet. So we're bathing him in tearless shampoo. And then you're gonna scrub, okay? <laughs> so we're using tearless shampoo, puppy shampoo, because he's only eight weeks old, so we can't use our regular shampoo on him just yet. Why did the pups get so much poop? <laughs> <laughs> Normally I avoid washing the face on puppies so that I don't scare them for their first appointment. But these guys were covered in poop, so washing the face it is. <laughs> You tell her. It only goes to five minutes. That's what I try to tell them all the time, but they never listen. Puppy number two is a female. This puppy doesn't like when we scrub it in. Nope. I sure hope these pups are all out of poop for their drive home. Good job. That's good. The tail looks like it's done. Just me get it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. If you're getting a puppy, introducing them to the bath and the blow dryer when they are eight weeks old is a great way to get them accustomed to the process when they're older. Puppy number three is a long-haired male, and I am absolutely obsessed with him. It's gonna get really fluffy. For those of you who watch my channel, you know that German Shepherds are my favorite breed, but my favorite kind of German Shepherds are the long-haired ones. He's got more hair, so we gotta do lots of little things. They look so beautiful and elegant, and they look gorgeous after they've been groomed. If you're interested in a long-haired shepherd, just know that they will require a ton of home grooming as well as professional grooming. Puppy number four is a male, and his name is Enzo. This puppy's sticky. But these were some dirty pups. You don't want to wipe his bum, do you? You're leaving it up to me. And last, but certainly not least, we have puppy number five. She's a female, and her name is Lupa. Yep, that's how you say it. This little girl is staying with me. So keep watching my channel for upcoming educational videos on how to get your puppy acclimated to grooming. I clip her nails and spray her in some blueberry bubblegum cologne. Good girl, Lupa. And these crazy puppies are all finished and are ready to have a blast in my backyard. Today, for our pet of the day, we have Murphy and Ginger, the Cocker Spaniels. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed these pampered puppies.